Now to return to Upper Cathedral from the Hunter's Dream, you want to come to the first tombstone. It's very hard to find right under Grand Cathedral. As you can see, there's so many, but right under Grand Cathedral, right above all the Arnhem, you'll find Upper Cathedral. So for this fight, in my previous video, we unlocked this shortcut that will be in the link in the description. And then you could just come on through here. I'd maybe recommend the old Hunter's Bone because you'll be fighting a good few enemies in here and you can parry these enemies, but it's honestly not even worth parrying this boss in my opinion. So right through here, there'll be a fog wall if you've encountered the boss already, but if you haven't, you can kind of explore freely up until you sort of get past these pillars, I think. You can feel free to use Beast Blood Pellet, that's highly recommended because that'll make this fight even easier, but it's an easy fight to begin with. Obviously, Executioner's set, you want to have maximum blunt resistance. As you can see, that's the Executioner set and the top hat. And then you can also use whatever weapon you want. I'm using Ludwig's Blade and pop some bolt paper. But like I said, Beast Blood Pellet will make this fight even easier because there's a bunch of minions you can just raise your beast hood on. Now for this fight, you just want to kill all the minions up until you find the enemy that doesn't have a health bar. It'll usually be standing back. Like you can see this guy right here, he's sort of chilling back. This fight is very similar to Rom because the first phase is very easy. I mean, he'll be summoning a few more minions, so I'd highly recommend you try and get rid of all of those as fast as you can. And that's why I'm saying use Beast Blood. You know, maybe I will use that Beast Blood pellet. This will be raised very quickly. So once you start taking on this guy, you just want to be spamming your hits as long as you can. You want to deal as much damage as you can before he gets big. Once he does get big though, you could use my favorite Ludwig strat of just big sword. You can stagger him pretty easily, as you just saw. Although, like I said, there's quite a few of these guys. When he does that attack, you just start bashing him. That's a perfect opportunity because at this point he should be so weak that you'll obliterate him. And yeah, Beast Blood Pellet, definitely your best bet in this fight because it'll be filled so quickly. Then light the lamp. And then to get to the next boss, you just want to break this and move on. 